Good day, everybody. Today, I wanted to talk to you guys about walking by faith. One of the hardest things to do. So let us meditate on this for a moment. There have been times in our lives where faith will waver or worrying will take over completely and we will start to doubt what our situations will look like and that maybe they won't change. You know how we do. Now, we've all been there in various ways, situations, and circumstances. In 2 Corinthians 5, 7, it says, For we walk by faith, not by sight. Very powerful scripture there. It's really saying we have to trust and believe in the things that we cannot see. Because God works behind the scenes, always has. And then we start to see things in the natural if we continue to have faith and believe in Him. Now, this is where the testing of our faith begins. Our real, true faith comes from being tested. And God is continually testing us. And by being tested in this way, we get stronger in our faith. Now, walking by faith takes a lot of trust in the Lord your God. And we have to trust that he will deliver on his promises to us as stated in the scripture. Now, if you believe in Jesus and have the faith, now this part is important. He will hear you when you pray to him. Very important part. Having faith when we ask for something or needing the Lord to help us in a situation is very crucial in getting our prayers answered. Now, it says in Matthew 21, 22, and whatever you ask for in prayer, you will receive if you have faith. See, if you have faith. That's a very important part right there. Now, I realize that in the middle of a storm, trouble and all kind of things start falling down around you. And it is extremely difficult to believe and have faith in those emotional and testing moments. But we must learn to have it. Now, I've also struggled with this in the past, and I still struggle from time to time. We're all human. But we have to remember that in Matthew 17, 20, it says, Truly I tell you, if you have faith as small as a mustard seed, you can say to this mountain, move from here to there, and it will move. Nothing will be impossible for you. See, we only need a mustard sized faith. Do you know how small that is? Very small. See, Jesus did all the work for us because he loves us so very much. And through him, nothing is impossible. Nothing. When it all comes tumbling down, have faith and pray to Jesus. When things look impossible, have faith and pray to Jesus. When you just don't know where to go or what to do, stop. Pray in faith that Jesus will take care of it and it will be done. Let us not forget that we have to read the scriptures from which all knowledge, wisdom, and revelation come by way of the Holy Spirit. In Romans 10, 17, it says, So faith comes from hearing and hearing through the word of Christ. Very powerful stuff. So when we read God's word, his promises, his life, his testimony, and how amazing our father is, we gain faith from his words, his deeds, and what he promised us as written in scripture. And always remember, his promises never return void. Declare his words in prayer. Remind God of what he promised and that you have faith that according to his will, he will deliver on his promises as he does and he will. As long as you have faith and believe in what you pray for, 
yours will be a great testimony for others who are wavering in faith. When you take one step forward towards God, he will give you exceedingly above all that you ask for, for his glory. It can be so hard to do sometimes. I know when you are in trouble and you are in the middle of a tornado, I know about this firsthand. But I also know that I couldn't do it without God. I couldn't do it. And I absolutely know that God is an awesome, faithful, and gracious God. Know that God is always with us, providing us the guidance and the strength that we need even when we don't see it or feel it. And even in the most vulnerable of times, he is working behind the scenes for our good. Lean on our Heavenly Father, no matter the circumstances, and He will never forsake you. God bless you all, and have a wonderful and fruitful day.